I am excited as hell. Can I curse? Can I say hell? Yes. Cool. Um, I'm excited. I'm nervous though because um, I'm supposed to be taking summer classes. Um, apparently, I'm like six credits short, but um, I don't have like the funding for this. So like I'm graduating, but I'm not. I don't know. I'm kind of like in limbo. Um, but I'm excited for for graduation because you know school is now closed. That chapter is done. But I'm 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 scared. I'm not your typical comm major, like I don't eat, sleep, breathe, Hobart Halls. I'm very involved in a lot of things, so um, I've learned a lot about the PR majors and event planning and all of that and promotion and all of that based off of the events that I had to plan and promote, but as far as like how the real world works and you know how a real station is ran, no. Um, the only thing I got from that is, is you know, you got to know the right people. Uh, it's not about talents, it's about who you know, mm -hmm. not what you know. Um, but a lot of the t skills that I've gained, I've learned when I was in high school and I taught myself how to work Final Cut Pro and all that stuff. So I guess I've never really been challenged. So I learned a lot of the stuff from me, not from Willie P. You want to know what I'm involved in? Uh, this is gonna be a long laundry list because um, I'm the vice president of the Student Government Association. I'm the yearbook editor. I was the co-chair of the African American Heritage Celebration Committee. I was the president of art of the Residence Halls Association. I was a member a member of multiple clubs. I've been um, I participate in various events. Um, I feel like I'm forgetting stuff, but you know, I'm old, I'm about to graduate, so you know, that comes with the territory. Um, as far as outside projects, I started writing a script for a sitcom called Damaged Goods. Um, I've used one of the episodes for my class project, for my capstone final, actually, and um, I'm really considering taking that on and making that an actual like pro, um, program for YouTube or something like that, but um, I work at an event planning company, so I do a lot of their promotions. I've done their monograms for weddings, and I've done their logo, their logo, their mail, their mailing slip, their brochures. I'm working on their email and my um their website and my website as well. Um, I started a YouTube page. I've done a lot. Outside of Willie P, I didn't realize that until just now. Ooh, uh, I don't. I would like to say that you know you're gonna see my name in lights and it's gonna be everywhere. I don't really know what the future lies ahead of me. I hope that uh, Damaged Goods becomes a sitcom for YouTube. Um, my my website will be up and running soon. Hopefully, now that I don't have classes to worry about anymore. I mean, I already wasted like twelve dollars on it, so I might as well start start planning it. Um, uh, if you look, if you're on the lookout for uh, J2L's events LLC, I do all their promotional items. I do. Um, hopefully, you'll see my stuff. You just probably won't know it's me unless I tell you. But I like. Uh, hopefully, I'll be doing a lot of event planning, um, a lot of uh, layout programs, brochures, logos, websites, sitcoms, videos. <laughs> Um, I plan on starting actually a series called Girl Let Me Tell You and it's going to just feature me and some, some of my friends and we're going to talk about events and uh, 
gossip and TV and stuff like that. I'm not sure if I want to make that a blog, or like a radio blog station or a YouTube series, but I have a lot of ideas in mind. Hopefully all of that will just come into fruition. My advice is don't be afraid to march at the beat of your own drummer. Um, you know, though this university offers um, a okay program, um, a lot of what you learn is based, well, what from my experience, a lot of what I've learned is what I've applied on my own, what was not required of me. A lot of, of the getting involved on campus is not required in the comm department, I just do it anyway. Um, me writing the series because I was bored wasn't the, involved uh, in, because of the comm department, I just did it anyway. So if you're really passionate, just don't be afraid to trail your own path and mark, uh, march to the own beat, your own beat because you are an individual that can bring something different to the table. Not everybody has what you have, not everybody has your flair. So don't be afraid, don't run away from it. Embrace it and highlight it.